There you go. You got it. Hey, good morning and welcome back to the channel. Debbie and I are at Gooseberry Badlands. We're in the middle of nowhere, Wyoming, and we're en route to Casper today. But we want to stop at this BLM site and activate it for amateur radio for the first time. But we are taking the mile plus hike first before we do that. And as you can see, this is a unique little land area. So thanks for coming along on the adventure. We'll see how it goes. We must go around this ridge here. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, those are cat tracks. Mountain lion. Great. All right, let's keep going. You go first, though. Here's some mountain lion cat tracks. So I'm having Debbie go first. Whoa. You're good, you're good, you got it. Wait for me. There you go. You got it. I didn't actually see this part coming. <laughs> Go left up the stairs. Just take your time. Hush. Where's the trail? Were we down there? Yeah, I think so. I think the trail, yeah, we were over there, there, yeah. Cool. I was more worried about a mountain lion. Okay. You should have brought your gun. Oh, good. I have my gun on. Okay. told me that when we were talking about that mountain lion. Oh. Can you take that picture? I did not. Yeah. That's about the most interesting mile hike I've ever done in my life. <laughs> I agree. That was beautiful. And now, I'm going to set up the radio. I see 705, 10 watts. Wolf River coil with the Faraday cloth for speed. And we'll see if we can activate Gooseberry Badlands BLM site 
for its inauguration. So we're just putting a Faraday cloth, Wolf River coil, picnic table, we'll get it started here. I will try to come back to him. He's in the VA hospital in Loma Linda, California. Okay. I'm going to get started. We'll come back and try a single sideband in a second. I'm using um, SDR control with an iPad, or I could use my iPhone if I wanted to. No wires, do an FT8 with the ICOM 705. And I'm going to call CQ POTA, Kilo Uniform 3 Charlie. I bet you a lot of my stations will be California. SWR is like 1.2 to 1, 20 meters. Whiskey Zero, Sierra Zulu Hotel has come back to me. The strong signal report. I have a uh, Kilo Bravo 9, Romeo Papa in Wisconsin. Alright, first contact in the log. The 20th of June. We've been on the road at least three weeks. Um, just sort of track of time. Can Kilo 6 Whiskey Hotel Papa? Got a contact, so he's number four. Call him CQ Pota again. 20 meters is up and down, it appears right now. I'll see if I can keep working it. Switch bands. Boy, I'll tell you for quick activations, I can't beat the Wolf River coil. Or really, maybe any 17 uh, foot whip. But I can put this up, I have the extended legs on it. And I can put it up like in four to five minutes and be on the air. And if you're driving around, activate new sites. It's a great vertical antenna to use. I have my infed halfway with me and a mast, but again, that's a little bit more effort. So let's see where we're at here. We're up to, just logged another one. One, two, three, four, five, six, up to six. And then again, I'll, I'll do uh, some single sideband once I've activated this site. It's never been activated. Gooseberry Badlands. And as you can tell from the hike, it's interesting out there. Good news, I just uh, got my 10th contact in the log, so this park is activated for the first time ever. And I'm um, going to get a couple more and then switch, uh, if I have time with Debbie, <laughs> to some single sideband before we take off. Well, that wraps up the activation of Gooseberry Badlands BLM Scenic Overlook for Amateur Radio. Inauguration of this park for the first time ever on Amateur Radio. I appreciate all the hunters who reached out to me. I appreciate Debbie's patience the most as she waited for me. And now we're headed to Casper, Wyoming. As always, thanks for coming along on this adventure and all my other ones. Have a great day. Take care. Bye-bye. Producer, remember. <laughs> and welcome back to the channel. <laughs> I got to do the sun, Deb. Oh. I wonder if nobody comes here.
Nobody does come here. That's not true. We'll get all this arguing on video. Thank goodness. <laughs> I'll be able to relive it in my... I think a lot of people do. Oh, nah. She's been a great... Uh, those. That was much better. I'm That's gonna, the winner. There's going to be lots of outtakes on this particular video. <laughs> mainly of you. Because I'm recording all of this.